Hi everybody, um, this is a video documenting uh, the ongoing development of a noise generator plugin um, that I'm building in Max for Live uh, for use in studio work and live performance. Um, this is version 1.0, which I built last week. It's got three filter presets. It's got a low pass filter, high pass filter, and bad pass filter. And it's got a gain control down there. This button here, the active button, should activate uh, the plugin, but it doesn't at this stage, so I'll need to come back to that. The latest version, version 1.1, retains uh, the low pass, high pass, and band pass filter presets. Um, in this version, it incorporates another set of presets uh, being noise colors. So I have pink noise, brown or brownian noise, blue noise, and purple noise. At this stage, I'll admit that uh, these aren't necessarily faithful um, to the theory which underpins the colors of noise. Uh, the reason being that my grasp of mathematics and max theory, specifically sending messages to patches and such, isn't up to scratch enough um, to be able to make this um, that accurate. So in this case, for the sake of this version, I'm I'm really just relying on my um, on what I see and what I hear um, each of these colours of noise to be based on um, the basic theory which underpins each of the colours of noise. I'll just go through them briefly. Pink noise um, should have a decrease of three decibels per octave. So you can more or less see that in the shape there. Brown noise has a decrease of 6 decibels per octave, so it's a much more sharper drop there. Blue noise has an increase of 3 decibels per octave. And purple noise, lastly, has an increase of 6 decibels per octave, but it begins at 1000 hertz. So I'll just give you a quick demonstration. Pink noise. Brownian noise, blue noise, and purple noise. I'll just take you inside the patch and show you the cuts. So first of all, uh, we've got a gain control over here. Um, here's the filter graph that you can see um, in the presentation mode. Here we've got the presets for the low pass, high pass, and band pass filter. Down here we've got the presets for the colours of noise. So we've got a couple of um, we've got a couple of bangs going to a low pass filter, a couple of bangs going to a high pass filter, and then uh, frequency gain and resonance values there. This part up here is a typical uh, fussy TLR patch, really, um, and a bit unnecessary. It could be um, it could be pared down a fair bit, and all this basically does is just defines the background colour um, for when you select pink, brown, blue, or purple. So it's a cosmetic inclusion, but you know, kind of useful in a way, I guess. So um, if any of you watching this video. <coughs> Are interested in the patch or are willing to give any suggestions that would be fantastic. Um, I've put up a large image of um, the unlocked patch uh, up on my blog. Um, the address uh, you'll see here on the YouTube video in the subject heading. Um, now next couple of versions of the plugin I'm hoping to, well I will incorporate a uh, LFO, uh, maybe a comb filter, and uh, once I've boned up a bit more on the maths and max theory, hopefully we'll have um, these noise colour filter shapes uh, a bit more faithfully rendered. But in the meantime, see you later.